ClickUp Hierarchy Explained. Hi guys, welcome back. Today I'm going to be giving you a basic tutorial on ClickUp, how ClickUp works and what is the ClickUp Hierarchy. So let's get started. The link for ClickUp is given in the description down below. You can go ahead and check it out right now. ClickUp is a project management software that works really well for your projects and for your different tasks. On ClickUp, it is divided into a hierarchy and we have different workspaces, then we have spaces and list. And each list has different statuses and statuses have different tasks. Let me show you how it works on ClickUp. So the first thing that you need to do is create a workspace. Workspace is like the basic of your ClickUp and you will require a workspace to get started. You can have more than one workspaces if you want. And with workspaces, you will be able to create a new workspace. You can see right here, this is one of my workspace. And to create a new workspace, you can just click on this icon right here. And it will allow you to create a brand new workspace. Keep in mind that our each workspace has its own data and own spaces. And we cannot integrate them into each other. We can also join another workspace if we like and we can be a guest there or have our own workspace. So this is one of my workspaces. And in my workspace, I have different spaces. All of my spaces are given here and you can create a new space anytime you want. Click on new space and it will allow you to create a new space and then we will be able to create different list. Let's give it a name or we can also use a template. On ClickUp, there are different templates available for spaces and for different lists as well. So if you want to create a project management space, then you can use this template right here. So let's go with a template. There you go, our space has been created. And this is how you can create a space within a workspace. Our workspace can have different spaces. So you can create a workspace for your work and then you can create different spaces for your HR, for your sales team, for your management team and others. So once you have a space, then you will be able to create different lists and folders within a space. For example, this template also has a list for us. So if I click on it, now this is our list. And this list has different tasks and different folders created within. This is going to be our one of the list, which is for agile management. We can also go with HR and sales for a different list as well. So this is my list and I can create different tasks within a list. Now we can create different statuses. We can add tags, due dates to our tasks that we create within a list and we can organize them the way we like. And each list can have different tasks for us and different due dates, different team members, and we can assign these tasks to them. We can also add different tasks and different lists within a folder. So if you want to create a folder, you can just click on this plus icon anytime and it allows you to create a list, a folder, a sprint folder, or import a template anytime you want. If you want to change a template for your space, then you can go to the template center anytime and change a template for your space if you like. So in simple words, we have workspace. Workspace has different spaces. Different spaces will have different lists and lists have different tasks and folders created within. And this is how ClickUp works. Now you can go ahead and organize your work to your task level. You can divide and create different workspaces, more than one for yourself and for your team or join other workspaces as well to communicate and to customize your work experience. Similarly, we can create different spaces and divide work really easily and organize our ClickUp. ClickUp is all about productivity and saving time. And this way you will be able to save time and get more organized. This brings us to the end. I hope that I was a big help to you. Now you know the basics of ClickUp. The link for ClickUp is given in the description down below. You can go ahead and check it out right now. 
Don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up, leave a comment down below, turn on bell notification and subscribe to the YouTube channel.